All kinds of families. All kinds of families by Mary Ann Hoberman, illustrated by Mark Turrent. Families, families, all kinds of families. Families are people and animals too, but all sorts of things fit into families. Look all around you, and you'll see that they do. A knife and a fork and a spoon are a family. The stars and the sun and the moon are a family. The socks in the drawer, and the rocks on the shore, and the blocks on the floor—they can all become families. Bottle caps, ginger snaps, buttons, or rings—you can make families from all sorts of things. As soon as you're born, you're part of a family. As soon as you're born, you're a daughter or son. As soon as you're born, your family gets bigger. As soon as you're born, it. Is bigger by one. Eggs in a carton can seem like a family. So can a loaf with its slices of bread. Celery stalks or a big bunch of carrots. They sleep in the fridge with a drawer for a bed. What other things can you do to make families? Pennies and card decks and marbles and jacks. Ribbons and ho- and bobby pins. Hair clips and thimbles. Pencils and rulers and crayons and tacks, bottle caps, ginger snaps, buttons or rings—you can make families from all sorts of things. Clams in the sea make a clammy family. Lambs in the field make a lammy family. Jams in their jars make a jammy family, and yams in the cupboard a yammy family. Out in the yard, you'll find dry twigs and branches, horse chestnuts. Barberries, acorns, and cones. Down at the beach, you'll find pebbles and seashells, soft-colored beach glass, and ocean-smooth stones. A saucer and a cup can be brother and sister. A comb and a brush can be husband and wife. A plate and a bowl can be Mrs. and Mister. And so can the spoon, or the fork, or a knife. Your hand is a family, a family of fingers. Your foot is a family, a family of toes. And as you get older, each family gets older. And as you keep growing, each family ke- family grows. Bottle caps, ginger snaps, buttons, or rings—you can make families from all sorts of things. If you are the firstborn to your mother, your mother's a mother because you are here. If you are the firstborn to your father, your father's a father because you appear. If you are the second one born in your family, someone is a brother because you arrive, or someone's a sister and you are a sister, or a brother the moment that you are alive. You can make families from clay or from play-doh. You can make families from mud or from snow. You can make families from paper or cardboard. Make them from sticks or balloons that you blow. Spools are a family, and tools are a family. And chalks for the blackboard at your sh- at school are a family. Six slices of cheese or a pod full of peas, or a key ring with keys. They can all become families. Bottle caps, ginger snaps, buttons, or rings—you can make families from all sorts of things. You might say that numbers belong in a family, or alphabet letters, or notes in the scale. Your colors and the colors in the rainbow is the words in a language. The keys on a piano or stamps for the mail. Inside or outside, in snow or winter, you can find families for so many games, families to play with, spend most of the day with, telling them stories and giving them names. Bottle cap, ginger snap, buttons or rings—you can make families from all sorts of things. Make believe families and families of people, families of people from long, long ago, families like stepping stones crossing the water. Leading to now and the families you know. Everyone comes from a number of families. When you look back, it looks like a tree. People from families make other new families. The more you go back, the more people you see. 
Play families, real families, all kinds of families. Think of the families, the ones that you're from. Someday you'll grow up and you'll sh- you'll have a new family, and you'll be the family of families to come. Good for you. What does a healthful meal look like? Look at the food groups on the food plate. They are part of a healthful diet. Let's learn about these food groups. Fruits and vegetables are full of vitamins. They give you energy too. The food plate shows that we should eat more vegetables. Fruits, vegetables, grains are grains have fiber, minerals, and vitamins. Breads, cereal, rice, and pasta are grains. Grains. Protein helps to build bones and muscles. Egg, meat, and fish have protein. Beans and nuts have lots of protein too. Protein. Some dairy foods are good for you. Milk and yogurt have calcium. Calcium is good for your bones. Dairy. Choose your meals from these groups. These foods are good for you.